Hello students. Today I will show you some pattern additions. That is when a particular number is repeated and you have to add some of those numbers then how do you find that sum by using a shortcut. See the first thing is we must know when ones are repeated in order like this. Say I am taking four ones at most. So 1 plus 11 plus 111 plus double one double one. Now we know that this 1 is repeated maximum 4 times in a number. So you don't need to find the sum by writing them uh, one under the other. Just write the sum as start with the natural number 1, proceed up to the highest number of 1s. So we have 4 1s, so we get the sum as 1, 2, 3, 4. Likewise, if you have five, if you take 5 1s, the answer will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 ones, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on. Now using this pattern, you can find the sum of some of the very special sequences of numbers which are quite often asked in competitive exams. Just like we have the threes. Now suppose you are asked the sum of these. Suppose we have five threes maximum. Now, once you know the pattern of ones, how you find the sum of these numbers, you can easily find out this. Because this is actually three times your the first example which we have done. So if you know the sum of this, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 because 1 is repeated 5 times maximum. So you have to just find the product of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 with 3 which will give you the required result. So we can find this out now. 3, 5 is the 15, 5, 1 carry. 3, 4 is the 12 plus 1, 13, 3, 1 carry. 3, 3 is the 9 plus 1, 10, 0, 1 carry. 3, 2 is the 6 plus 1, 7 and 3, 1 is the 3. So 37,035 is your required answer. Look, we do, do not want to write all these numbers uh, in a sequence and then perform the addition because you will consume a lot of time in writing the numbers like this and then adding them vertically. So if you know this pattern of addition then this type of addition will consume only 2 to 3 seconds to calculate without actually writing them in the order in which people write it. Now one more example for this say we take 8s now we have 8 then add that to 88 to triple 8 and then to double 8 double 8. So you know that 8 is common here and you have 1, 11, 111, 11, 11 left out. So 4 ones, so 1, 2, 3, 4. So you find the product 8 for the 32, 2, 3 carry, 8, 3 to the 24 and 3, 27, 2 carry, 8 to the 16 and 2, 18, 8, 1 carry and 9. So 9, 8, 7, 2 is your required sum. This involves use of only one step that is multiplication. That's all. And you don't have to write the question all over again. Now, let us extrapolate this method for finding the sum of some decimal numbers also. Now, say we have, we have to add 7.7, .7, then double seven point double seven, then triple seven point triple seven, and say we will take one more, double seven double seven point double seven double seven. Now, again this is a very tedious method if you write them one underneath the other and then perform the addition. Now, the rule here involves two steps. Because we have number before decimal and number after decimal. The number is same obviously. The number before the decimal is 7, 77, 777, 7, 7, 7, and number after decimal is also the same. But in case of these kinds of problems, you have to do it in two steps. Now obviously 7 is common. So first step will involve multiplying 7 by likewise we did this. Just forget that there is something after the decimal. So the question becomes 7 plus 77 plus triple 7 plus double 7 double 7. So if you do it this way then it will be 7 into 1 2 3 4 which will be the product. This will be 7 plus 28 8 2 23 2 6, 8, 8, 6, 3, 8 is the 
product but this is not the complete answer because now we are left with the part which is after the decimal place so now for doing the part with after the decimal place again multiply by 7 but this time you have to reverse the order in which you are doing it here so you have done it by 1 2 3 4 now do it by 4 3 2 1 this is what you have to remember that when you have a question involving decimals then the second part this number will be reversed now find the product 7 1 carry 2 carry 30 2 4 7 now see the final answer will be obtained by having a decimal after one place and then adding this number to this number. So the final answer will be you have 8638 8 here and before decimal you have 3 here. So 38 plus 3 is 41. So 8641 and after the decimal you have the same number 0247. This is the required sum of this question. See these two steps will take approximately 3, 3 seconds to calculate. So 6 seconds and 1 second for this. So you have answer in 7 seconds. Whereas if you write all these numbers one underneath the other, you will consume at least 15 seconds to solve this question. Okay, let us conclude this by taking one more example. I am complicating the problem now. See, we have, now we have the mixture of two numbers, say 8.4. Now we have double eight point double four, then triple eight point triple four, and let us take one more double eight double eight point double eight double, double four double four. Now let's solve this. Now again, uh, you observe before the decimal place we have eights, so eight eighty eight triple eight and double eight double eight. So the, the product will be eight multiplied by four eights, so one two three four. And on the other side of the decimal, you have 4 repeated. So 4 multiplied by, now since it is on the right side of the decimal place, we reverse the order. 1, 2, 3, 4 becomes 4, 3, 2, 1. Now just find these two products first. This will be 9872 and the other product 17284. And now put a decimal after one place 1.7284 and add it to this so final answer will be 72 plus 173 so 9873 and after the decimal place you have the same number 7284 which is your final answer so you see knowledge of one of the patterns of numbers will form the base of so many questions which can appear in clerical aptitude tests, in numerical aptitude tests and in every competitive exams which involve simplification questions. So this technique can save you a lot of time in exams and anyone who is appearing for competitive exam must know these techniques to save a lot of time. So keep learning, keep sharing and subscribe the channel if you like it.